Okay, here's another problem in the category of numbers. Uh, we're dealing with new num two numbers. One number is 4 less than another number. The sum of the two numbers is negative 22. Wow, negative 22. What does that mean? Does that, so our techniques will still work when we have something like that? Well, let's find out, see if we can figure this out. So I have two numbers. One number is 4 less than another. So let x be the smallest number. Let x equal the smallest number. So how do you express the larger of the two numbers? So what is the largest number? Well, would it be x minus 4? Well, wait a minute. If I subtract 4 from x, then I get a smaller number. So it can be that. If one number is 4 less than another, that means that the bigger number must be 4 more than the smaller number. All right, so let's try that. x plus 4 then must equal the largest number. And that will work. All right, now we have our two numbers defined in terms of x. We now want to find a constraint, something that will help us solve the problem. And here it tells us that the sum of the two numbers is minus 22. Okay, so the smallest plus the largest adds up to minus 22. All right, again, I took the sentence of the constraint and turn it into a mathematical equation. And now I'll replace the smallest and the largest by what we define the mass. Since the smallest was defined as x, and the largest was defined as x plus 4, I'll replace smallest and largest by x and x plus 4. So now we have x plus x plus 4 equals minus 22. So now we have a familiar linear equation. Uh, let's get rid of those parentheses. So x plus x plus 4 equals minus 22. Now I want to move all the numbers to the right side, all the x to the left side, they're already there, so we don't have to move those. Move the 4 across over here. Remember, when we cross the equal sign, the sign changes. So this becomes x plus x equals minus 22 minus 4. Combine like terms on both sides. 2x equals minus 26. Divide both sides by the numerical coefficient of x. x equals minus 13. Okay, now let's go back and define, let's, uh, so let's see what we define the numbers at. So since x equals uh, the smallest number and x equals minus 13, the smallest number equals minus 13. And since the largest number is 4 more, when we add 4 to minus 13, we get minus 9. So this equals minus 9. And if we combine the two, minus 13, minus 9, indeed, they give you minus 22. So we've got the right answers.